dropless cataract surgery has of late become quite popular in USA. There the surgeons mixes moxifloxacin, triamcinolone acetate and vancomycin. The mixture is called trimoxy vanco. After doing cataract, after completion of the lens implantation, a certain amount of viscoelastic is injected into the sulcus between the iris and the lens capsule that widen the sulcus area. Then with a 27 gauge cannula, we introduce it to the transgenular space and inject into the vitreous cavity. Uh, we have done it in six cases. We are not injecting vancomycin. What we are injecting is only Vigamox and triamcinolone acetate. Uh, the purpose of not using uh, vancomycin is that there has been quite a number of reports where intervitreal vancomycin is causing retinal vein occlusion. So here is the technique going into the transgenular space with a 27 gauss cannula, then inject there at a time. Uh, many times some amount of the solution comes out through the hole we have made in the journals, but when you remain, wait for some time, everything gets settled down. Here you can see we are going to inject moxifloxacin and triamcinolone acetate, and here it goes. All the amount has gone into the vitreous cavity. Some has percolated back into the AC, and that is not a big problem. So only time will tell whether this new system gets popular or established, because it totally eliminates the post-operative eye drops.